Hello, s excuse me, let me start over here. Hello, fellow StarCraftians. Mixmaster Mike here again, doing some self-cast while I practice being an idiot on uh, TV. Um, here with my buddy, excuse me, wrong side. Here with my buddy, Devin, um, Istine, we'll call him. I call him Justin because that's what it looks like. But uh, I'm actually being Protoss. I'm converting everybody. I like them better, and so should you. Um, Justin, Istine, is also being um, Zerg, and he's practicing with them. So this is a practice match for us. We're uh, Bronze Leaguers. Uh, he's a buddy of mine from work. And uh, here we go. We're going to be playing against uh, Protoss Trotero and Zerg Sydney Boy. So these guys are going toe-to-toe -to -toe with us. Same, sames. Um... What I'm going for is a typical build for Protoss. I don't really know how to do it, so I hear about this four gate. So I say, "Hey, let's try to four gate." Um, I'm learning how to do it as I go. Justin's helping me. Ah, I gotta stop calling him Justin. It's Devin, and his name is Istine. But um, anyways, I forget what he does this match. I have to be honest. Um, we're gonna see what happens. But I know what the other guys do. Um, they do pretty typical builds as well. Um, you know, this guy might go forget. I actually haven't watched this video yet, so we're going to see what they do for the first time together. Uh, this is a forge. Um, interesting. So that says things to me. And this guy goes double gas zerg before much else. Uh, spawning pulls down. Um, but, you know, Devin, excuse me, Esteem. Anyways, send my probe over. Esteem's going to grab it. And, uh,. You know, he's going to do things with it. He's going to scout with it. I'm going Cybernetics Core because I hear warp gates are good. I just hear these things from protest players. Some say, hey, let's try this warp gate thing. And uh, Istin says, hey, I'm just getting gas. I don't know why he's taking so long. But he's doing it. So Queen's coming out. Um, I'm getting out some uh, zealots. And this guy is just doing cannons. Um, gateway and a cannon. We haven't scouted yet. I probably should have just done that myself, because then we could have seen this before the inevitable happened. But yeah, production tab, what do we got? Um, not much right now. I mean, I'm not even making zealots as we speak. I should be, but, it, uh, you know, I'm not. So, I got my first zealot out. Some pylons coming down. I'm going to go four gate. I've already told you, and this Dean is... I mean, I'm assuming he's going to go Zerglings at some point, but I just, he doesn't get units right away, so that's that. Uh, two cannons go up uh, right as we want to start scouting, which is unfortunate, but I'm going to try to throw down a pylon. I'm not sure what I do. This could be... Oh, this is Trotero. Excuse me. Not even my guy. Um, yeah, I think I got blown up. We didn't even see it happen, so great. Istine expands here. Uh, the expands in this game kind of suck, so... Um, I'm going to go with my four gates. There'll be a third. I'm just bad with timing. Um, these guys are churning. Uh, we got cannons up the bum. Cybernetics Court went down late. And this guy still is having his... What are, what's the unit tab? Probes. No one's even building anything. I'm, I could have won this game by myself with these two. But I'm going to go Stalker. Um, and Istine is still just... Macro. He loves his macro. He's slow with Zerg. It's our first time doing this. Zerg is weird anyway, so anyone who can do it is just godly, in my opinion. But, uh, anyways, nothing happened to these two things. They're just there for no reason. This is just sitting around. Uh, I'm confused, I'll be honest. So, I don't really know what the deal is with this, with this Trotero character, but he's churning out these probes, and I did not know he was doing this. Now I do. But I've got a little army here. Um, throw that down. And I'm going to go... Hopefully my warp gate's on the way. It should be. Just about here. Uh, so warp gate's going to arrive. And uh, I don't know if I even notice it right away. Anyways. Warp gates are opening. This guy... 
drops two bases. Oh my god, this is interesting. So, two bases go down on our side of the map. This map is kind of weird. I'm just starting to learn it, but I'm sending out my proxy man here. Um, so I'm going to get nasty with this. I think that's me. Yeah, that's pretty blue. i got to pick a new color, FYI. But anyways, stalkers warping in, zealots. Um, I'm probably thinking expand soon too, am I? I don't know. I should be. Um, but anyways. Istine expands, he's transferring probes, goes double gas. Um, and we're at seven minutes, so I'm well within my reasoning to be where I am, I think. So, um... Just as these things are going to come online, this guy still doesn't have units. He's just got cannons and he's praying. Oh, well, wait a minute here. So he goes Phoenix first. Now, I don't know why you would go Phoenix first unless you were trying to protect the harass. But at this point, the harass probably would have already happened because, I mean, there you go. So I expand at eight minutes. Doing well. Got some good army. And I've got a lot of money, and it's coming in faster than I was expecting. And apparently with Protoss you just get money faster, and I like that. But this guy's mining, and he's pumping out probes. And this is doing the same. He's going to have a lot of money here, and I think this is who we end up fighting a lot. But uh, Zerg double expands as well, but late, and you're Zerg. Why did Protoss expand before you? You should be embarrassed. But uh, you also don't have any units, so... I just am confused by Zerg still and currently. But I'm building a little base here, and I'm hopefully warping in. And I'm hoping that Justin gets things to do soon. Oh, he's got Mutas. So if you rush Mutas and you're Justin... Ugh, Justin. Istine. I'm retarded. Then you get... You get them in about nine and a half minutes. So that's what we did, and that's what he's going to do. And I think this is going to be very bad. I didn't actually see his harass, but... With these th four undefended bases, this is just sad, and I think that's what happens. But um, we're gonna need an army when this when these angry uh, opponents get going. Um, probes transferring for me. I'm churning them out as well. But I feel like two bases is okay for me. I probably could expand, but I mean I don't know anything about that. So in your poop, Nick. So anyways. We fight on. And I actually feel like we lose this match, but I don't know what happens here. Um, yeah. No one likes a Void Ray. And this kid is just straight up going Star Point. He's got a lot of money. He's not spending any of it. But he's bringing out uh, Void Rays, and that sucks. But I've got Stalkers, and those are okay. So, um, Observers... And here's the harass. He's trying to draw the army, as I believe what he said to me, as I build up. But he's going to harass this. I don't know where the void rays are, but this guy doesn't seem to care much about this base. I don't know where the void rays are. But he's hiding them. He's even hi Oh, there they are. Excuse me. He's one void ray. I say it as if it's a big deal. But this team's feeling confident. This guy's got mutas, but not that many mutas. And uh, as far as the units go, I'm cruising. He's got lots of Phoenix, and I don't. I feel like that's great against Muta. And he must have scouted us with an observer. I mean, does he have an observer? He doesn't even have an observer. But the mutas will continue to harass. I'll continue to build an army. I don't actually think that this team is building anything. He's not. He's just harassing like a douche. But that's a lot of Phoenix, and that's that's no fun for Mutas. So I feel like switching would be a good idea, and I forget what he does, because I was solely involved with my own fighting. And You'll see how special it is to fight with this team, because he likes taking army units from you a lot. And it's okay with me, because he's good, but I'll be good soon, and he won't be allowed to do that. But anyways... My base goes out. My forge is getting some weapons for us. I don't put these both down, and I'm just probably still deciding what the hell I'm going to do. But uh, I feel like we decide Robo is the way to go. But 
I forget. So the Nexus is lonely. It should be building, but it's not. That's my third one. This guy's money is probably outrageous. And these Phoenix, I don't, I don't know what you need this many Phoenix for, and I don't know what you need that much money for. But you're going crazy, Stargate. This could be the map where we got void rated to death, um, and I believe it is. But we'll see how this actually happens. But um, void rays are just coming out. I'm scared of them, and we don't do enough to see that happen. So um, I'm going to take my army. And I'm going to see what happens. Um, it's not really an army, it's just stalkers and a bunch of slow zealots. Which is sad, but, uh, <laughs> you know. We'll chill. Uh, Zergs are spinning. That's, that's a scary amount of that. And this is the thing, is... Istine should have won this, and I was very confused as to why. And I feel like the reasoning is... He's upgraded these crazily. And this is why I was confused at first. I said, how is he doing this? Um, that's how. His buddy leaves the game for no fucking reason. And that's just not cool. But the sad thing is... This is not going to go well for us. This guy's got crazy stargates. The units... I can't wait to see how many forgeries he actually ends up building, but... Here he goes, taking out his base. He doesn't take out the other base, because we don't know about it. And the problem is we didn't scout, and my army is handling Zerg. And I remember saying to him, should I even be attacking Zerg right now? And he said to me, yes, we should be. So I did, took it out. He had to choose, and what happens? Justin, his team, you deserve that, Justin. His team runs away, and his whole army goes down. My whole army gets lit up right now. This team goes in. This goes badly for everybody. This is just outrageous. Void rays are scary good. They're scary good. And air was not the way to go with this. I should have went sky toss earlier. Um, now we're panicking because we know this is not going well, so I'm going to speed this up. Um, but... Guess what that is? A pylon. I don't know when that got destroyed, but it was great that we did it. But the Stargates keep going down. Um, we don't even know what hit us. And I think... Oh, mortals. This is what I said to Justin. <laughs> Justin. I said to Isti and I said, hey... I'll get the ground, man. You'd handle the air. And he said, fine. And he just busted out corruptors. I believe is what happens is, yeah, look at this. What is that? So he sends these corruptors just pimping around the map, looking for this army. Um, in the meantime, this guy's going a fourth base, which is really a third because he lost it. But still, it's four bases. And this just grows. And it gets so scary that I, I want to say he gets over 20 of these things. But they get fully leveled up. Already on the way. 3-3, three, three, I'm sure. And what do I got? You know? Didn't respond well to that defeat. Istine's point out his corruptors. He's saying, oh yeah. Mike, check these corruptors. I said, dude, let's do this. So they find my proxy, which never was used, and sends out... How many voids is that? That's like not that many. 18 voids, and takes out my base like a boss hog. It doesn't. The Ruckers hit, and they're... Just, look at this. I actually hadn't seen this disintegrated. And now this gets scary. Um, they take my base out. They head right up to us. goes down. Boy rays kill us. They're just massacring everyone. My poor, ex overly expensive immortals are destroyed. My base, the probes. He actually tries to expand two more times. But what's happening is happening. They're 
has 20 void rays, fully upgraded, destroying my life. And they're just pouring over. They're just gonna keep pouring over. And we can do nothing about it. I try to run my probes away. It's funny because it's a void ray for each probe I have. That's that. 